All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, how are you today? I hope you're doing all right. I'm doing good. We have just gotten back from uh, retrieving Constantine. I want to talk to some of my people, if I can, to see what's up. Greenblood, my friend. Do you need something? No, um... What happened exactly with Major Herman? I was just a kid then, but I was sent to an elite camp, although one must say that I was gifted for my age. This is when Captain Herman took charge of me. We were beaten almost every day. Jesus. We hardly slept, and he humiliated us at every opportunity. The same treatment as Rainer, Wilhelm, and the others. Except... Herman occasionally came to visit us at night. Yeah, but it's something I'd rather forget. The bastard went up in flames, and all my memories along with him. Anything else? Shit, really? I must leave. Um, that is not how I wanted that to turn out. Um, let's see. Carrots, I am glad you came to talk to me. Oh, what's up? I have something to ask you. I'm listening. What do the women on your island do when they really like someone? Everything is so complicated where you come from. In my culture, we do not talk about our feelings. Especially not amongst nobles. Marriages are arranged more often than not. <laughs> I knew it. Never mind. I'll do it my way. Your body and your soul are speaking with mine on all Manawi. And if you feel the same way, I would love to spend some time alone with you. Aww. Yes. I would love that too. Meet me outside my room the next time we're at the house. I will be there. Anything else? No. I must uh, leave no. you. See you later. Well, we're at the house now. Does this count? Let's Let's see if it counts. Honor Manawi, do you still agree to spend some time with me? Yes. Of course. I was waiting for this moment. Come. I have never met someone like you, on Almanawi. My heart has never beaten so fast for anyone. What about you? Do you think you are my Menundanem? I hope so. Because I love you too, Siora. Kairto. This is how we say I love you in our language. Koden nes greda komolai. Our two hearts beat together. Oh my god, it's so cute. But yes, yes, very Twitch friendly. Kurt, were you watching that entire thing? <laughs> Dude! Alright, let's go, let's go check on Constantine. Of course he was! <laughs> Kurt Savoyer or Exhibition. What's the di I don't know what the difference between those two things are. And, and I don't want to really look them up either. <laughs> All right, cousin. Let's go speak. Let's see how you're doing. You should get some rest. You're not being reasonable. Tell with reason. I've rested long, and I'm well enough. You've just barely woken from a stupor that had you on death's doorstep. The affairs of state can certainly wait another day. Let <sighs> Thank you, my lady, but I am amazingly well. You can take leave of me with no fear. 
I assure you. He just escaped a deathly sleep, and here he is ready to conquer the world. Your cousin is exasperating. <sighs> what now? Are you going to scold me as well? No, no. I'm just relieved to see you're still alive. I'm quite relieved myself, actually. Thank you, fair cousin. Without you, I would be dead thrice, wouldn't I? Or is it the fourth time? If we start counting the time you stop me from climbing the ramparts of Serene, we'd be up to five times now. It's unbelievable. You feel no pain whatsoever. And your complexion. <sighs> I haven't even taken a look at myself. Is the improvement visible? I would not go that far. How is it that... what happened? Don't make that face. It's merely a major miracle. Come on now. I'm gonna tell you everything. We have been waiting for your return. I knew you would do everything in your power. I have always trusted you. But Katasak feared that I would not hold on long enough. He spoke to me about a ritual that would help me. I was excited about it. And in spite of all that has happened, I don't regret following him. We went to the ancient site. A place full of magic. I followed his instructions. And all of a sudden... What? An incredible sensation. I felt better than I have ever felt, cousin. Alas, we had very little time to celebrate. Cries came to our ears, and beasts jumped all over us. We fled for a while, as other soldiers fought through, creating a path to join us. But I can see from your face that you know this already. Indeed. Once on the ritual site, I followed your tracks and deduced what had happened. Yeah, not the fact that you would look like absolute death after it, though. Um, that's about the High King's motivation. Ask him why he has he wasn't killed. For more details about the ritual. Tell me more about this ritual. What did it consist of? It is, I think, a ritual that the Done Garda practice to bind themselves to the island. Done Garda? Katasak taught you their language? Just a few words. He wanted me to learn, to understand, but we had so little time. So he visited this infamous site, where he prepared for me a sort of potion. What ceremony? I had to cut my hand in front of an enormous stone, and there, a gigantic beast came, and started circling around me. It was incredible. I truly felt a bond with that place. Like a wave came through me, as if the power of the island was running through my veins. It was marvelous. And now I am Onwal Manawi, like you. Even if the Malachor left me a few of its marks. Well, okay, um, why didn't he kill you? Do you have any idea why he didn't kill you? Like the others? No, no, not really. It seemed like he was trying to tell me something though. He spoke about isolating me from the world, that I couldn't return to the earth. It made absolutely no sense. But aren't you happy that he let me live? Don't speak foolishly. Of course. I just want to understand. Wait, Twitch told you to get get a new phone? <laughs> it seems that Vimbar was targeting you specifically. Did he say anything to you? I was still very weak, and most of the time he whispered in his own language. It seemed that he was speaking to someone and following his orders. But there was no one other than us, cousin. The crazy madman must have been hearing voices. But you had to encounter the god of the island, didn't you? How was a non meal Frichtemann? Yes, I passed a trial for that. But the only one who could guide me to the sanctuary is dead. Oh no. Do not tell me. And yes, only the High King can open the sanctuary, according to Glendan. I have no choice but to return to see him. I'm certain they are going to name a successor. Okay, well, new High King, ask Glendon for help. Okay. Oh, that's, that's stupid, what? How is Twitch's tech support that bad? Or support, I guess. 
tech support, regular support, doesn't matter. How is it that bad? Alright, back up north. Oh, just because it's Twitch? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, it's sort of like YouTube in that regard. Good day, Glendon. Beort Tirtomat, Karans of Katasach. We learned of his death. And they washed Tire. Alas, his was not the only tragic loss. Your High King Vinbar is also dead. He was taken by folly. He went away into the mountains after killing Katasak and capturing my cousin. Nothing I could say would allow him to see reason. Are you telling me that you were the one who killed him? Ker Tonsidach. What happened? How could a friend of Katasak do such a horrible thing? I am sorry. But your High King did not leave me the choice. He was about to kill my cousin, and then he attacked me. He was becoming a guardian. Another egg. Perhaps it was for that reason he lost possession of his wits. I believe you. You have sufficiently proven your friendship. But something escapes me. Why? Why would Vinbar have done such a thing? His offering to Tiafradi does not justify what he did. You know that I wished to see Enon Milfrichtemann, and he was the only one with the power to allow me to do so. I would not have caused his death voluntarily. Believe me, I am just as sorry as you. Andevorscht, Tire. We will celebrate his memory as well as those of all the members of our council that have fallen. Bloodnit. Katasak, and now our High King. These are dark times, but in spite of our mourning, we must elect a new High King. The children of Tiafradi cannot remain without a guide. All the more so in these troubled times. I will notify the Mal of all the clans, so that they may know to travel here. Who has a chance of being elected, in your opinion? Deirdre is powerful, and many clans would follow her. The wisdom of Dunkas will also attract support from many. And there is also Ulan, a clever fox who is very capable of convincing the entire world with his honey-dripping words. Deirdre, Dunkas, and Ulan. I must convince them to help me if they are elected. I suppose. I must begin the preparations. You must leave now. Okay, so... Earn at least one of the pretender's trust. Convince Deidre to support you. Convince Duke Dunkas. And convince Ulan. Who will win the vote, in your opinion? I don't know. Each of the three chiefs that I spoke of could win. It is possible that some amazing feat places one of the Mal above the others. If Bladnid had been victorious, she would certainly have won this time. But that was not to be. Is there anyone else among those presenting themselves? Do not take me for someone born last summer. You want to influence the vote for your own gain, but you shall fail this time. And you must go before the one we have chosen. Can I do anything else for you? Understand. I understand. I must leave. Goodbye. Qua awelem se. Alright, let's go, uh... I like Dunkus for the role. Oh yeah, and I bet after you told them that, that they probably just stopped talking, <laughs> communicating. Where is my friend Dunkus? Hey, what does... Let's see what does there. There's the house. 
Knock, knock, don't cuss. Just Siora <laughs> to answer your question. What brings you here on Omanawi? Uh, what about you? How, who else? I am the bearer of bad news. Vinbar, your high king, is dead. Ande vosh tire. He was a great king, and a very wise Donegad. We haven't seen him in a long time, but his memory shall be honored. Glendan told me that you would probably be among those who would want to take his place. I am not looking for power, but Tiafradi needs peace and balance. And I fear the other kings may want war, or be motivated by ambition. The Renaise brought chaos with them, and our island has suffered. We cannot change the past, and chasing away those who came does not make sense. The wound is there. Refusing to acknowledge it is pointless. But wounds can be healed, and my clan knows how to do this. So if you're worried about my intentions, if I were to become Hoi King, I'll lay them out for you. We must find balance with those from the remote island and live together in harmony. But for this, we must teach the Renaixe humility and to respect the earth. I would like to meet Enon Milfrichtemann in order to find an antidote for the disease that is destroying my people. If you were elected, would you help me in this endeavor? You are a Karantz of our clan, and I have witnessed your wisdom and benevolence. I would be glad to help you meet Enon Milfrichtemann, and I pray that he will help your people. But you should know that my election is far from certain. The spirits are divided, and some are thirsty for revenge. Would there be a way to make sure that you get picked? I do not like the idea of using such a method. But yes, there is a way. Let's hear the it. High Kings of old wore a legendary crown, said to be a gift from Enon Mil Frichtemann. The one who became the first guardian is believed to have taken it with him in death. If someone were to wear it in these troubled times, they would definitely be chosen by the others. And where can I hope to find it? In the burial mound of the Hoi Kings near the village of Vignamri. But it is said that the path towards it is strewn with spears, and that its entrance, situated near a large dead tree, is guarded by a Nardaig Magamen. It is a deeply holy place, and a guardian will not let anyone enter without a fight. If you do decide to go there, fill your heart with humility and respect. For those who rest there were great men. Now we've earned the trust of one of the pretenders. We just need to find that crown. Are you certain you are willing to influence the fate of all my people to meet an Anilfrichtman? I understand that you might find this idea unpleasant, but the survival of the whole continent relies on this encounter, Siora. It is my feeling that you do not understand the consequences of such a decision. Everyone on the island will listen to the words of a High King. Are you certain that you've chosen the right ally? If not, we can go and find another. What's a little menial work when compared to the fate of this whole island? You're right. It's a decision that is more important than our quest for an antidote. I must dwell on it. I mean, I'm pretty certain, but uh, that's colonialism, baby. <laughs> and, and, and let's keep this straight. I don't trust Ulan at all. <laughs> like, not even close. You only get one chance to betray me. Oh, holy shit. Uh, Kurt, what kind of sword are you using, buddy? Hmm. Dunkas is the only one I really kind of trust, because he's already shown that he's, 
he's willing to live in peace, but he's not gonna be a, uh, violent psychopath if it comes to it. <laughs> he's a wise man. One serene mace. No. I'm looking for a great sword. Any purple ones that we can use for him? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Give who a necklace? Where are we headed? I just sort of started running and I know where wait. Was this blocked off and that's why I didn't get it? Let's see if it's see if it is or not. If it is, I have one science now, so I might be able to grab it. This the right way? Good. And if only we could super- oh, son of a bitch, really? Alright, fine. Oh yeah, I also crafted a shit ton of ammo. <laughs> what are we at like now? Like 361. Alright, is it back here? Huh? Can I do it? There we go. Uh, let's turn that off. And so... Okay, so we just keep to the left. It would be on my left. Wait, what are you talking about, ray gun? <laughs> what? Alright, you're just fucking with me now. I feel you. Okay. That's not throwing me off. I was like half excited about that. That, that might have been a possibility. Devs do crazy shit like that all the time. The Infinity Gauntlets in God of War. Yeah. Te like, technically it is. Okay, um... Oh wait, no, I bound it. Whoa! Okay. Gotta love them eight shot pistols. Let's see if the move away. Things are about to get dicey. Oh, it's a stasis. Okay. That's good for crowd control, I guess. That didn't work. Things are about to get dicey. Yeah, it's a god. It's not. It's not a. It's not the Marvel Infinity Gauntlet. It's a God of War version. But it it does the exact same things. Things are about to get dicey. 
Come on, you big fucker! I know, it's pretty cool. Wait, what did I do to you? I was talking about the Nadai. Two kingdoms? What do you mean by that? Oh, hello. Hello! Oh, shit. Sup? Hold on. This is, a good, this is a good spot for it. Oh, shit. Come on, get it off. There we go. Not enough adrenaline. Nope. Why do I need adrenaline for that? Now, why would you add that for Twitch to see and get me banned? Nah, I don't really care. I was just kind of joking. Wait, so... This... That's an exit. Can't climb up that. Does this take me out? Did I miss a turn somewhere? And how how would I do that? I don't I wouldn't know how to give you anything. Okay, so maybe down this way? Since I came from this way. Yeah, but would I ship it, or, like, what are you talking about? Or do you mean the, uh, San Francisco bear? Can I get up there? Fed as in Federal Post Office or FedEx?
What are you doing there? Here lie those who fell facing the first invaders. And you dare enter and scatter their bones. I did not come here with the intention of defiling this place. No. You came looking for a crown of the High King, hoping to choose the one who will lead us. Isn't that what you are looking for as well? Yes, but I am not a Renaigse. I wish to lead my people to victory, and I have come here seeking something that will make it a certainty. And so? Do you plan on keeping it for one of those who is too wise or cowardly to come and get it themselves? Or will you give me the crown? Dertre is a great warrior. If she reigns, she will unite all of the clans. And with the blessing of Enon Milfrichtum and the people of your island will be chased away from here. Think long on this. If you leave her the crown, she will become the High Queen. You will not be able to change your mind. If I give you the crown, you shall be named High Queen. What will you do with this power? You have already shown to all that you are not like the other Renaixe. I will not hide from you the truth. Tirfradi does not want to welcome your people. They toy with us, take without returning, kill and pillage. I will unite my people and cast all of the Monesenaig into their ocean wagons. They will go and pillage elsewhere. You want the crown so you can more easily rid yourself of my presence afterwards? If you give it to me, you will become our Karants. And we do not chase away our Karanten. And also, you are on all Manawi. You are bonded to this land, not to theirs, no? Uh, speak about the need to enter the sanctuary. I have come here looking for this crown because I need the help of the next High King. I must meet Enon Milfugdemon to ask him to heal my people. Are you sure that they are your people? Very well. It is a very great honor you ask of me. But you took great risks in order to obtain it. If you give me the crown, I will open the sanctuary to you. You may speak to Enon Mil Frichtimon. I swear this to you. So the option here is either peace, or war and we go home. Sorry, Deirdre. I believe someone other than you must become the High King. Someone more easily manipulated, who will obey the orders of the Renaixe, no doubt. Too bad. You leave me no choice. I have come to take that crown, and I won't leave without it. Just opens up one. Oh yes, okay. I love that. Enough. I accept my defeat. Take this crown. I am not worthy to wear it, so it seems. Indeed, so it seems. We will meet again at Doorhead Genador. Until then, Deirdre. I shan't be eating anyone's heart. That is not what we do here. <laughs> Unless it's absolutely necessary. I mean, I didn't fail to convince her. I just chose, well, I convinced her entirely. I just didn't uh, go along with it. Assert dominance, eat heart. I don't have the heart to eat. Wait, what? Right, whatever, let's get the hell out of here. No, no, I do not. Excuse me.
like, what the hell is this? Why have I not seen that before? Oh, that's near the mines. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. And get that later. No, I am not supporting the Zuck. And plus, you make the mistake of assuming I have a soul. Are you the only one here? No. Things are about to get dicey. Okay. I will take that. Again, it's not really a choice if you don't have a soul to sell. Do I now? How do you know this? Travel we go. Return to Donha Gonna do Do I just give this to Dunkus when I see him? I guess so. Oh my fucking god. I went into the tomb. I found the ancient crown of the High Kings. And so you entered into one of our most sacred places. May this adventure have brought you wisdom and understanding of our people and of your own history. This relic is venerated. The one who wears it will certainly be elected. But you know that, do you not? Yes, I do. I need to be certain that whoever is named will help me meet Enon Mir Frigdeman. I have pledged my honor to help you, and my words are true. But more is being played here than a simple meeting. You know that I work for a tempering of spirits, the healing of wounds of Tifredi, and those of your own continent. But the decision is yours. To the daughter that was lost and refound on our island. Take it. I trust you. In your wisdom, may we be guided towards a peaceful future. The council has begun to unite. It is time for me to go. Thank you for choosing me. I will do all in my power to bring you what you desire. You have my promise.
you say you trusted him like it's not like I had the option to just put the crown on my own head. Congratulations, Dunkers. I'm certain that you will be a very wise High King. And now, are you ready to keep your promise and take me to meet with Enon Mil Fuchtemann? You are burning with the impatience of youth. But according to tradition, I must first go to the sanctuary on my own. Without the blessing of Tifradi, my title is nothing but empty, meaningless words. But fret not. How could I be called wise if I went back on the promise I made my friend as soon as I got elected? Meet me at the sanctuary's entrance in two days, and I will open its doors for you. Thank you, Dunkus. I'll be there. We spent two days twiddling our thumbs in this village. Don't you think we have better things to do? Uh, take care of some missions in the meantime. I don't think I have any missions, but I will talk to my companions and see what's up. Because there were a couple I didn't talk to. Like maybe Afra or... I don't think Vasco has anything else, but like maybe Afra might or uh, Petrus. What in God's name are you talking about? <laughs> I did not have the option to keep that crown. You watched it happen. You forgot to add the word not in that. My dear child, what can I do for you? Okay, nothing for him. I will see you later, father. Take care, my child. Afra? Desade, I'm happy to see you. Can I do anything for you? Need anything? I'm under the impression that you've not learned as many things as you wanted by observing Dorcas's clan. That's true. I hope to discover the physical or alchemical mechanism behind their metamorphosis. But instead, I don't know. I think I now understand the bond that unites their people to this land. The links that connects them and the power of their culture. It's unexpected. I wonder if this couldn't become another subject for study. The study of people, their customs and beliefs. If I said that in al -Sad, people would think I've gone mad, but... Here, everything is possible, right? Learning about the natives would allow us to stop being afraid of them and to see them like fellow humans at last. Yeah, what you're talking about is called anthropology. Sometimes social studies, leave. and it's included in political science. Glad to see you, my friend. Can I do anything for you? Well, I must leave you. Okay, well, time to sleep for 48 hours. Sleep. There we go. And the option was to keep it to give it to another king. Not keep for myself. Wait. Oh, okay, so just up that path. Sure, buddy, as you say. Straight to the mountain. I'm not doing that.
Here you are, Karantz. How was the encounter? Enon Mil Frichtman welcomed me like a mother would welcome her child. Or you will have to meditate on everything he told me and think about the warnings he gave. But now he's waiting for you. I will open the way. Once you are in the sanctuary, always stay on the right-hand path and keep a confident heart. Those who let doubt take hold of them and turn back risk awakening the guardians of this place. Kwa Aulam Seg. Understood. Okay. And no, that's not selfish. <laughs> not at all. Okay. Heading up this volcanic mountain. It's really wet up here. <laughs> then again, I guess there might be hot springs and sulfur pits. In we go. Those are just seamless. Holy shit. I hail you, Enon Milfrichtemen. I have come to you to find a remedy. A cure for the disease of a distant land. Her affliction was to be poisoned by her own children. Her veins rocked in stagnant water. Her earth now bears poisoned fruit, and her children wither and toy. And still it is those same children who can heal the lands and with them heal themselves if they only want it truly. They could be taught by my children learn to give back in return learn to heal but for that, I must survive. I have seen by your side the shadow grow, taking form. Fed by the venom of intrigues from faraway lands, he spreads it today in my sap. To save his own life, he stole my strength, and that strength has driven him mad, because it is not made to be taken. He draws each day a little more from me, and threatens us 
His hunger has no limit. I don't understand. Who are you talking about? The one you call Constantine. You must stop him. Or there will be no cure anymore for anything or anyone. That's... that's impossible. How could that be? You must leave now. Someone has followed your footsteps. Someone has entered here without invitation. My children are waking and tracking. They will attack all four of us. Flee, or you will be dead. Okay, time to go. Time to go. Now you clearly see I did not have the option to fight that thing, right? I saw a man running out of the sanctuary and I heard the cries of creatures inside. Is everything all right? Did you manage to get the answers you were expecting? Yes. He told me that the Malachor had appeared because of the way the Colonials have treated the Earth. It is actually some kind of poisoning, and it would be possible to cure it, but I'm not sure that I understood how. Words that come from the heart of the island carry with them a wisdom, which may sometimes be difficult to grasp. If you need help, I would be glad to be of assistance. My clan knows how to heal the Earth. Thank you, Dunkus. I suppose I just need time to think. You haven't told me everything, have you? There appears to be a storm weighing down on your forehead. It is true. But it is something I must verify by myself. Oh, I see. Do not hesitate to come and find me if I can help you. Qua aulum secarans. Goodbye. It's called sweat. Oh my god. Oh, level 30. Lovely. Okay, so I got two ability points. Do I get it? I don't get anything else, do I? No. 31 and 33 respectively. What do I want to do with these? I can heal myself more. Fury. Wait, what is this? This is rolling. I don't really need that. Okay. How do I get out of here? Oh, no, there's a question mark, so we're not even going to worry about that just yet. Oh, there's a camp. <laughs> Let's go home. Okay. So, we're going to talk to Constantine when I return. So, thank you so much. Drop me a follow if you haven't already. And I will be back in a moment.